Applied Music Theory for Unit 6. Let's listen to Shenandoah. Looking at our key signature, we notice the one sharp, that F sharp, that's our leading tone, isn't it? So we must be in the key of G. Let's review our G scale. And building chords on our G scale, we have the one chord, our two chord, three chord. Notice that F sharp in our hand. Four, five, six, and seven, which was so much like the five, seven, isn't it? And the one. So we have our melody. It's for the G chord, isn't it? Still G. There's our four chord. What might we do here? We have lots of time. It's a slow melody, so we could put the bass in. And while we hold, drop in a chord. Maybe chord. Maybe low C. And then still come up to that C position here. And a chord while it holds. note. So our execution here was playing these close positions of one, four, five, seven, but catching a bass note coming up in the middle of the measure, wherever there's a nice relaxed pacing or tied note, coming back still to the chord nearby. If we don't have time to go all the way down, something on that order. The idea here is as long as you're playing the harmony indicated, you're okay. So explore, experiment, see what kind of sounds you like. Make up your own arrangement. That's the beauty and that's the fun.